James Elder, Eiffel TV, in association with MTK Global. I'm in hold today with me, Gavin McDonald, ahead of his WBC World Title Challenge against Ray Vargas. How are you feeling, champ? Very good, mate. Uh, it's here now. Time, do you know what I mean, to, to go get my first world title. I'm really looking forward to it. Now, you're a guy that told me that his dream was to win a British title. When you won the British title, you even suggested that you, you felt that you'd overachieved in winning that against Lee Wood. What does it feel like to get this opportunity now? Yeah, like I said, in press conference, um, each fight, you, you, you get better. You pick your goalposts up when, when, you, when you get to where you want to be. And I won that British title, and that was a dream come true. Do you know what I mean? I, I didn't think I'd go much further than that, but um, I won that, picked my goalpost up, moved it to the next one, do you know what I mean? And that was European. And now we're at the world title, and I genuinely believe I'll, I'll win the world title, and, and it'll be a start of a, of a, of a, a big year for me. I'm my brother, but a big year for me. Do you know what I mean? I really want to make a name for myself on the world scene. And this is my time now, and I intend on uh, grabbing it with both hands. You're in with 28 and 0 Ray Vargas from Mexico. A lot of his fights have been in Mexico. How, how much have you seen of Vargas yourself, or how much do you know of him personally? Um, just seen him then. He's a bit bigger than me. Do you know what I mean? It's, just, um, it's the first time I've ever fought anybody bigger than me, but it don't don't bother me. I'd rather him be as big. I mean, you can work downstairs and whatnot. So, at the end of the day, I've seen what I've seen of him. Um, it looks good, but um, he's coming over here. Do you know what I mean? He's fighting a man who will do anything to win, and uh, that that's going to be the difference. Fight night. Do you know what I mean? I'm gonna I'm gonna go in there, and I'm just gonna I'm gonna pull it out of the bag one way or another. As much as you've been gaining a reputation and building up the W's and winning titles, you've always seemed to be sort of in the shadow of what Jamie's doing. Do you feel this? This victory, getting your hands on that WBC World Title, said, will help you make your name within your own right. That's it. Um, I've, I've always been um, compared to my brother. Always been in his shadow, and and this is the the time really to to, to step out of his shadow, step stand side by side with him, uh, and be there there on uh, achievements. Do you know what I mean? Because this will be a better world title than he's than he's got. So I, I've got a little bit of pull in the uh, conversation, you know what I mean, when we're arguing and bantering. Um, so it's one of them, uh, it, it means more to me than, than, than anything to really, to, to, to win this and, and stand there, you know what I mean, side by side with him and, and both be as good as one another. What, what type of fight are you expecting from Vargas? Clearly you're going to need a career best performance in, in the media's eyes to get this W, but what, what type of fight are you expecting from him? I'd, I'm just expecting the, the toughest night of my life, um, willing to go through anything to win. Um, he, he's sharp, um, he's fast, you know what I mean? His record suggests he carries power. Um, so you, you can only expect um, an hard night's work. I, I would never, there's no fight, uh, an easy fight, you know what I mean? And, and anybody can win a fight, but uh, Saturday night, it, I'm expecting a very, very, very tough fight. But one more, I'm more than, uh, confident of winning. Steffi Ball's been with you from right the get go of your career, managing you and guiding you. How sort of how pleased are you with the job that he's done and getting you to this point in the link up with Eddie and then facilitating you to get a world title? That's it. Steffi Bully, he, he's not just uh, my manager, but he's, he's one of my best mates. Um, he, he's looked after me um, many a times, you know what I mean? And, and there's more than. Uh, there's more than boxing. When boxing's done, we're going to be very good friends and, and lifelong pals. And uh, for us to, to, to be on the journey together, uh, do it all together. And like I said to him, I only said to him earlier on, I said, in boxing, you, you, you move managers, move, you move promotions. But me and him, we will uh, we'll start the journey and finish it together. The only other WBC champion in the country, Tony Bellew, he's in the gym day in, day out with you. What advice has Tony Bellew given to you coming into this fight? Uh, Tony, uh, I mean, is a big inspiration to me, Tony. I mean, I like what he's about. Um, he only has to be in the same room as me and, 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 and I can feel like I, I want to go conquer the world. Um, he's given me little pointers along the way, do you know what I mean? And um, obviously he can't be there fight night because he's got his fight, but um, I'm sure he'll be, be willing me on, do you know what I mean? And, and once I've, I've won this, it's time for him then to... Um, Go out there and, and beat David A. Your little boy's in the background, he wants his dad, so it's time for yes. you to go out yeah. and fight him over and into dad duties. Yeah, no, not dad duties, no, no. I'm out of the door, mate, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's his mum who looks after him. I mean, you can't really, this close to fights, you can't be giving me, me, me all my uh, energy, do you know what I mean, to a little three year old 
bombing around. I mean, they, they tire you out, so I'll have to look after him, like, do you know what I mean? I'll make, make for exit. Best of luck with the party today. Brilliant. I'm out of grab it, it's there for you. Thank you for the support. Cheers, mate. Thank you.